Can you uh, you're able to hear us? You're able to hear us okay, Noah? Yep. All right, we'll go ahead and call the meeting to order. Um, we would like to add one agenda item. So I guess 3C, discussion of uh, professional services contract. Uh, it's a special meeting. We are allowed to change the agenda, but really, I guess no different requires a majority vote of the board to change the uh, agenda for a special meeting, emergency meetings, you can't change the agenda. Um, so I would make a motion to go ahead and add item 3C, discussion of uh, professional services contract. Is there a second? Second. Any discussion? Go ahead and roll call. Uh, Noah? Aye. 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 Kevin? Aye. Mark? Aye. I also vote aye. Okay, so we have a third agenda item. We have the floor is open for public comment. Is there any public comment? Seeing no public comment, we'll go ahead and move on to staff nominations. Meredith and I were talking. It's um, going to be the same executive session for all three. So I think it was one. Meredith, you have nominations for the three positions? Yes. So to begin with, um, I am nominating uh, Lindsay Ruggieri for the ASA pre K teacher position. I'm nominating Jessica Gagne for the ASA third grade teacher position. And I'm nominating Rose Pompey for the March 26 multilingual learner. I would make a motion to go into executive session under 1 MRSA 4056A, discussion of appointment of personnel. Is there a second? A second. Any further discussion? All those. Sorry, we have to do roll call. Noah? Aye. Jake? Aye. Kevin? Aye. Mark? Aye. Ross of Odai? Go into executive session. Do we have a link for Noah? No, I'll send you a Google Meet link. Just make sure you log out of the Zoom meeting first.
So it's back and you are unmuted. So you're good. Okay, so we have three nominations on the floor. Take them one at a time. I would make a motion to authorize the superintendent to proceed with the hire of Lindsay Ruggeri for pre-K. Is there a second? Second. Any discussion? Go ahead and vote. Come on. Hey. Kevin? Aye. Mark? Aye. I also vote aye. Next up, we have just, uh, I would make a motion to authorize the superintendent to proceed with the hire of Jessica Gandhi for third grade teacher at ASA. Is there a second? A second. Any discussion? Go ahead and vote. No one? Aye. Okay. Aye. Kevin? Aye. Mark? Aye. I also vote aye. And we would make a motion, I would make a motion to authorize the superintendent to proceed with the hire of Rose Pompey as our uh, multilingual language learner teacher at his, uh, well, K-12, pre-K-12. Is there a second? A second. Any discussion? Okay, we'll go ahead and vote. Noah? Aye. Big? Aye. Kevin? Aye. Mark? Aye. I also vote aye. I see Rose and Lindsay are both online, so welcome aboard. Mm -hmm. well Next up, we have approval of the position. This is uh, not a position. Actually, come to the board for the filling, but approval of the creation of the position for accompaniments required. We'll cut the memo, but you want to introduce that part of it? Sure. Um, Yes, as we sought to hire a, a new choral teacher and we're kind of looking into how that structure in other districts, often having an accompanist is um, the model that's used. It's quite rare that a director does the full-time accompanying for um, the choir while conducting and directing. Um, and so it, when we were, um, going through the hiring process and uh, preferring as a, a, an interview committee, we, we learned more about this and our applicant pool just confirmed that that is what we needed to consider moving forward and the individual we hired confirmed that that's something that, that they would need to be successful in the position, a successful in the position. And so I, I mentioned this to the board previously, we've done research now and we have learned that it's structured many different ways in different districts. We uh, like the approach of making it contracted because this position wouldn't, it's not a natural fit for requiring um, a certification necessarily. And it's really uh, more specialized in terms of uh, the work they're doing and um, you know, feels itinerant in nature in terms of kind of the times they might be working depending on um, you know, special events and such. So that's why we went with the contracted service approach, which is the way it's done in some other places, and have put together this job, this description for the role, and we'll see with your approval, we'll see um, interested individuals to submit um, proposals to us. We're told the going rate um, is in this range we've identified here. Thirty to forty dollars an hour. We're told it actually can go up to fifty dollars an hour. Um, we feel like what we've learned in this area is that other schools seem to be somewhere in this range if they're taking this approach. So that's what we've put here, but depending on experience. So uh, with the time that we've outlined this year, we estimate that um, it could be between eighty-five hundred and and eleven thousand five hundred, just depending on what the rate of pay ends up being. We do have some surplus kind of flexibility in that line, since there was some money added to that at the budget meeting in the event we needed to go out and find a full time teacher. So we do have some funds in the budget that can be used for this purpose. Yeah, I just never questioned the that Terry Henry was using in some of the key roles, but it turns out that's fairly unique. And uh, I learned during the interview committee from all of these sorts of you know, training the music teachers that this is a separate company. 
So um, I would make a motion to authorize the creation of advertising and hiring the position of the choir accompanist. Is there a second? A second. Any further discussion or questions? Hello? No? Hi. Kevin? Hi. Mark? Hi. I'll so vote aye. So the last item is the uh, addition to the agenda on the uh, professional services contract. Sure. We set up the architect engineering structure for our four self-managed projects. We chose to do a divided approach to check out, to try out two uh, different companies for um, two of the projects with one company, two of the projects with the other. Um, we had started work with both companies, but are at the point now where we feel like we really need to put them all under one umbrella. And so we're recommending that we approach Kaylee uh, Moore and ask them to submit a proposal to us for the central office and the ASA kitchen um, and auxiliary room um, model projects and uh, not go forward with Carpenter Associates anymore. So, because we aren't meeting for you know, another few weeks, we'd hope we'd like to get this initiated and move forward. So we're asking you to approve a not to exceed amount. Um, the Carpenter Associates contract was for up to ninety-eight thousand, but um, you know, I think that Haley, if we get up to ninety, I think that would work for where we are in the process. And um, I'm really pleased we got some initial work back from Haley Moore on the other two projects, and we um, really feel like they're the right place for us to do the bulk of projects. And we structured the Carpenter Associates project to just kind of dip our toe in the water a little bit and not go the full amount. And so we kind of put a pause on that project in a way. Just to be clear, we've spent a few thousand dollars out of that contract, so it's just a, it's a swap more than that. Contract. And the thing I would say that Haley Ward is working well with us is the value engineering is saying we have 500000 for this project. Tell us what we can do instead of come, you know, put a drawing down, come back with another drawing. So, so I would make a motion to authorize the superintendent to execute contract with Haley Ward for professional. Services um, not to exceed ninety thousand dollars. Is there a second? Second. Any further discussion or questions? Is there any vote? No. Hi. Okay. Hi. Kevin. Hi. Mark. Hi. Also vote aye. Okay. Here's the agenda. Is there any public comment? Last call for public comment. Okay, I would motion to adjourn. Is there a second? Second. All right. Vote. No. Okay. Okay. Aye. Kevin. Aye. Mark. Aye. I also vote aye. We're going to adjourn. Short and to the point, everybody. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks for making this work. Thank you. Thank you.